What's up, peoples? It's a terraformer. Well, let's play some more Senate. It's definitely not a V. And uh, today we'll be playing Mountain of Melons 5. Gotta say everything in reverse order. That's the only way to say it. I think I could probably get up there if I was skilled enough in magic, aka shell jumps. But I can't do them like that, so I'm not gonna even bother. I'll just play the stage normally, because that seems like a more interesting way to go about things. And also, yeah, that, that, that mushroom almost went away from me. It was pretty sad, because I, I may or may not need I gotta get off here. I'm gonna fall off it anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I kind of misjudged that. Oh, I probably need that also, or not. <laughs> I was fine, I didn't know. Chainsaw the right. This kind of reminds me of a section in the JDC collab, the, um, the last level, which I think that's actually where the, the levels that person has, oh hell no, has, is that's where they're present. So. Oh, oh, wait, crap. I forgot the thing. <laughs> I still made it though. So how do I do this? I guess that works. And I gotta be up here for that chainsaw right there down there. You see it? No, you, you can't see it anymore. Sorry. I was rewarded for my curiosity. You see, I saw the, the radish tops head thing. And I was like, you know what? That's probably there. And I didn't pay attention there either. I just saw a key and had to go grab it. here so then just wait for the thing to go and then move and then go yes <laughs> that's pretty neat i like the the ways these are utilized and used in ways i guess we're not going to be seeing an extra an extra sub level from sub map from here but that's okay i have this section where it's like oh and go and hopefully be <laughs> safe because that that could have went worse because i wasn't paying the most attention in the world it's too expensive and you know it, it's it's cheaper to just not and then have the the joke end abruptly because you couldn't think of anything else left to say about it um hi this is i don't know where i'm going i think that's part of the issue that i'm having here Yeah, so here I just kind of, oh, okay, well, <laughs> that was kind of silly of me, I didn't see that one ledge, and I was like, man, I don't know how to do that part, so I don't see where to go, and I thought it was the screen, but no, it was fine and fair, I just was being irresponsible about my thoughts of the ROM hacking experience because of what I'm used to, so the overthoughts are still affecting me greatly. Because remember that level in Sui Mario, uh, uh, the one, one vertical level where you couldn't see a damn thing, like, hacks that don't even mean a damn thing. How am I gonna get past this? That's how. <laughs> That's how. Oh, I have this little thing in the bobber. That's okay. Like, it's not necessary for me to even scroll the screen because there's probably gonna be a platform there. I'm gonna go down here, once again forcing me downward. Oh, these formations are pretty nice, because, like, I don't know, some packs they just feel like they're doing way too much of what the original SMW does. Like, especially Anna Kitty line guide levels, it's like just 
SMW, whatever level that is, bridge something, <laughs> and, but to more extreme, that felt newer, or thing, I don't know, maybe I don't know what I'm saying, maybe I do, that's not a mountain, that's a water, <sighs> 5 out of 10 will not play again, cause you can't totally damn levels, uh, what are we playing, Mario gives up, so that's the only hack that I know of that music in. I don't know what it is either. But this music is the... what is that called? Do -do 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 -do. It's the bubble crab dude. Yes? Am I correct? <laughs> I might be. I don't know why my music ometer is being borked. It's like, I am the best knowledge person. If you have to ask me anyone a question about a Mega Man music because uh, like I don't know what in fact reason it would be that you would want to ask me that about a thing but yeah the only problem with that port is that note that is like continuously ringing but I don't know if there's any good ports like with that song that doesn't have that note repeatedly ringing it's kind of weird collecting coins like I need lives or something. Maybe I will. I don't I honestly have no idea how hard this hack is going to get, so yes, I know it's tool list capability. Well that kinda doesn't mean anything to me particular, but you know, it, it said right on the box. It's like don't use game genie or whatever that save thing is that actually allows you to save state on the SNES, but why would you want to unless you're like doing speedrunning stuff? So yes, that that's where that conversation went. What is, what is this? What is the haps around this environment? Is this a sort of pseudo life farm opportunity? that I could squander by hitting the, 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 the run button. I guess I'll collect some more coins. Can I get another life before that one runs out? I don't know. I don't know how many coins they actually have, like, when they do that with a shell. I mean, if you do with a shell and against a thing with a multi-coin block, then, yeah, this level's really handing out the life, so I thought that... Why are you running away? Are they, like, do they know I have a star? Like, that's crazy. <laughs> I've never seen that before, and this one's just going into the ceiling. They don't know what the heck's going on. That's crazy. That is the, the weirdest sight. I am... <laughs> I'm utterly confused, <laughs> but in a good way. It's like, hey, that was an interesting experience, and we all enjoyed it, and I all did whatever that was. <laughs> yeah, coin fountains are one of the most exciting ways to get lives. Maybe not the most exciting, but the Pendulum Castle. Alright. Do I mean the, the thing pendulums, the ball and chain pendulums, or that platform pendulum, or the, the, these guys do pendulum action, because that, I'd be quite, well there's a pendulum, I did not recognize it, I'm probably going the wrong way too, so that, that's, that, that's good, <laughs> yeah, there it is, okay, I was totally, going the wrong way. It wasn't really overthinking things, it's just that I don't have a very good compass for what's progress and what's going for the bonus stuff, which is why I don't really play Yoshi's Island too much, because I, I, like, I always feel like I gotta collect everything for the extra stages, but I'm really bad at collecting everything, but then again, it's been a while since I've seriously tried to play it, but... You know, that's that's just what how it goes. I don't know. I did try that hack one time by Yogi, and I like, played pretty terrible at it. So that 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 happened. So is it paths? Is there any the path thing that I want? Not seemingly, but I got to experience both paths, and that is the most that you can ask for, I suppose. I guess I'll pick a special one out if I need to for the 
Company Dragon Coin Collect-a-thon. Which is kind of like the Yoshi's Island, but except a lot more arbitrary, because I just do it out of my own challenging free will type variety. Is that for... Oh, okay, it is for progress. I wasn't sure if it would be for progress or for just the, the coinage. But I'm get oh, 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 you are in a bad spot because I didn't want to fall in the lava. And they have very obtuse, is the word I'll call it. I, I, I'm the type of person that would have just fell into that lava, but I didn't luckily enough. They're very strange in the way that they react, and their hitbox will extend out even when they're not extended, and just affect completely your jump, and like if they're in the air, they will like just stop you in mid-air. Uh, it's really wacky, and I don't understand what kind of mushrooms these authors on, because all the cool kids call people with weird and funky ideas on drugs, so obviously I'm going to take those idiots' advice and <laughs> do the same. Nope, no yump, no yump, huh? That's so sad. Is this going to be for the dragon coin? Because I have been taking my time. Yes, it is. And yeah, there wasn't even any other way to get up there. So I'm glad I picked up the speed at the correct moment. Oh, wow. <laughs> that is multiple things going on. And if I touched one of them, I probably would have been hit because I would have been touching both of them at the same time. Um, following, fo oh, uh, it was indicated. <laughs> <laughs> so that's good. You don't want to get stuck did by your hitbox a million miles away. So that just would not be the good thing to have happen. Here's a, oh, that wasn't what I was looking for, but okay. This isn't really the ball story. Yay, there it is! But is there any lava someplace? I don't know. What exactly? <laughs> that was kind of silly. That's that helpful. I'll collect it, but it doesn't really do much for me. Uh-oh. Ajax. Okay, Ajax. Bring it on. Oh, you're this guy. Oh, I am decent at best at this guy, especially when your thing is, like, thing. Oh, you killed... You only take three hits. <laughs> Fish. <laughs> All right, buddy. I'm pretty terrible at this. Get... Oh, I don't know how to get in here though. Like, dead. Yeah. I have no idea because there's just hammers everywhere. <laughs> I literally just bounced that way. Cut. Oh. Yay! I don't know what I did, but I beat him! <laughs> that guy's crazy. <laughs> the one in Anna Kitty Presents only had one hand. Okay. The Apple Snowcaps. Well, I have one level before, and I hope it's not called Apple Snowcaps, because. Oh, well, you should really say I'm sorry for the convenience that you get to see an intact castle on the overworld, darn. It's like when escalators break. I'm sorry for the convenience, we just made stairs. <laughs> yeah, I totally made <laughs> No, I didn't. No, I didn't. 
Uh, 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 it's not a snow cap. Darn. Well, I guess I have to play it just to prove you wrong. Ooh. Uh, oh, okay. Thanks for letting me know that. That isn't really the factoid that you would just instantly know. So this song is King of the Mountain. It is ported by Maxadex. And also it's from the game of... What is that game called now that I think of it? Uh, Treasures of the Rudra. It was a, it's a Super Famicom game, RPG by Squaresoft. Now I'm just wearing things, but <laughs> anyway, yeah, it, uh, um, yeah, I wanted to have a power up. I could have just duck jumped probably, but you yeah, know. That would have been way, way, way too much It's, what am I gonna, what was I going to say, I don't know, but, yeah, it's a pretty neat game, it has some really good music, actually the overworld for VIP 5 is from that game, so you know it has damn good music, it, it has a really weird magic system, where it's like you type in the magic in a box thing, like a name input device, and then you get your, your, mantras or whatever it is that they called in that game but yeah i don't i don't know how i feel about that considering it, uh, it's like oh you can get all the magic in like your first time playing if you cheat but <laughs> which i think the one time i played it like way back in a, in a freaking day i did but whatever it's neither here nor there if i wanted to play it now i'd have to get like a reproduction copy like, do we really even know the validity of those damn things? Because I sure don't. Fun fact! <laughs> and I was thinking about it in the last level, but I was like, I don't want to be insulting. But then it's like, eh, this really isn't that hard. Um, ooh, Trails of the, the Powdered Snow are from Mega Man 03. I believe the porter is Atma. I know these silly facts. Um, I don't know if I released this video. <laughs> the, it was, um, it was a Commander Keen 2 video, and I don't know if it's the one that I have on, fin or Commander Keen 3, even. And I was talking about a video I saw of a certain person, SSOHPKC, <laughs> as it's been years since I've actually seriously watched the dude, but I was like, you know what, has that guy ever decided to do the toolless thing? Because I am legitimately curious. And it was funny because, like, the episode I watched was these two levels, or, like, it was probably more, but what I remember was the last level and this level that I'm playing now, and sure enough, he was not, and then he got to the boss. <laughs> yeah, like that, that, I mean, it's kind of a tricky boss, but he was saying like, oh, they gotta play all this to get back, it's not really that much, <laughs> but... Yeah, and then he was on this level, and he spent a good few tries on it before he said, you know what, no, but yeah, I did it on my first try, so I don't know. I guess that says something about what? Um. <laughs> I see. Might as well just get it, and if I die, whatever. So, yeah, I feel like I just insulted a person, but really now? I don't know. I don't know if I should have qualms about that. I mean, it's one thing to use tools if you're beyond, if it's beyond your grasp and you're already into a hack. Especially with the, with the quote-unquote normal difficulty system on SMW Central, that does lack some uh, normal difficulty in any way, but yeah, it's kind of justified, but... He just got really freaking... I don't know. It's neither here nor there. I was gonna say something I realized. No, I'm not actually that of that, and I feel like I should go on, especially since what I was last talking about, because it was kind of negative, but I, I accomplished more than I set out to today, 
and it didn't take so long, so I think I'll leave it. It's a good place to start off, and Apple Snow Caps won. This is not Apple Snow. Just look at it. Just look at the green grass around. Does that look like a snow cap? Maybe Apple. I am I am 98.2% sure that there's apple trees in that vicinity. But snow caps, you gotta go up here to, to find the snow. See you guys.